you said to be nice. That said, you also said that you, when you were first starting a business, you were a bit more of an asshole than you wish you would have been. Absolutely, yeah, yeah. Because I was more of a yeller. I was, you know, I didn't no, have- No, really? Well, yeah. You- <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what you see on the sidelines, you know, with me at a Mavs game, maybe a little bit, but I also didn't have any patience for somebody I thought wasn't using my kind of common sense, yeah. right? Because I was always on the go, 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 when I, particularly when I was younger, just trying to be successful trying to get to the point where I had independence. And I would tell this to people, you know, either you're speeding up and getting on the train or, you know, we'll, we'll stop and drop you off at the next station, but let's go where you go. Did you have trouble with the hire fast, fire fast part of running a business? Yeah, always, because I hated firing people because it meant, one, it was an admission of a mistake in the hiring, and, and two, the salesperson to me always wanted to come out ahead and it, I was always horrible at firing, but I always partnered with people who had no problem with it. <laughs> so I always delegated that. Well, that's the tricky thing. When, you, when you're when you working with somebody and they're not quite there and you have to decide, are they going to step up and grow into the person that that's the right or they're not? Mm-hmm. And, and it, in that gray area is probably where you have to fire. It was hard. Yeah, for sure. Because, you know, there is obviously a failure somewhere in the process. You know, what did we do wrong? And when I would interview people for jobs, I think 99% of the people I've ever interviewed, I've wanted to hire because in my mind, it was like, okay, I can figure out how to make this person work, right? And and then they wouldn't. And then, you know, people at the company would be like, Mark, you suck at this, you know? And so I, I always delegated the hiring. Yeah. I mean, I'm the same. I see the potential in people. I see the beauty in people, and which is which is a great way to live life. But when you're running a company, it's a different thing. It's different. And you got to know what you're good at when you're bad at, right? Yeah. I, I was good at, you know, I was a ready, fire, aim guy. And I always partnered with people who were very anal and perfectionist because where I could just go, 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 they would keep me, in, keep me inside the baselines. They would do the due diligence. I yeah, or, or just, yeah, the detail work, the dot the I's and the cross the T's.